Carruthers here, Education Director for Samvia. If you've seen us before, you know that we love our razors and we actually have a lot of razor content. And we wanna add on to another razor video that we had before where we taught you some of the really fundamental pieces of razor cutting. So what our recent discovery is, is how to really control the angle of the razor in relationship to the hair. So let me first show you this on a, on a flip chart here. So the angle of the razor is really essential based on how it actually reacts with the cuticle and with the ends of the hair. So first thing that happens a lot of times is if the razor comes in and it's too perpendicular to the hair strand, if it's coming in almost at a right angle to it, as that razor blade comes down the surface of that hair, it's not only not cutting very well, but it's actually shredding up the cuticle layer on the actual hair. So if we take this angle and we go too far the other way, if we come in and the razor comes in at more of a flat angle to the hair, what tends to happen is we come through and we do this. So if you look what that does to the end of the hair as it travels through, now we have a very loose and thin little piece at the tip of the hair. So it creates a very weak piece of hair. Not to mention if you're too flat, you're gonna to struggle to get through the hair with the razor and it's gonna take forever. So really what the most beneficial angle is going to be is somewhere in kind of a 45 degree. Because if we come in at a 45 degree with, with the razor, what it's going to do is it's gonna cut cleanly through and it's gonna leave us a much more blunt end to the actual hair strand. And that blunt end really solves the challenge that a lot of our clients have with a razor, which is that they feel like it leaves the hair feeling very rough or very raw. It can also lead to almost a feeling of having split ends. So let me just demo what this looks like on a real piece of hair. So if we take a section and we have the rotation of the blade more perpendicular to the hair, if you listen closely, oh, it makes a horrible sound. You're literally scraping the cuticle off of the hair. It's horrible. And you can see I really didn't cut very much. So if I come in the opposite way and I rotate the handle of the Signature Series uh, Samvia razor, if I'm too flat, I don't cut very much. And what I end up with is you can actually even see the little bit of cuticle scale that's on the razor itself, and it's because I was at the wrong angle. So it really destroys the ends of the hair. So the most ideal position of the razor in rotation to the hair is at a nice angle. So what you can do is just take the, the blade here and lay it flat against the head. One of the reasons we created a swiveling action to this razor is so that you do not have to change your wrist angle and all you have to do is rotate the blade slightly and now you're at a perfect angle to come through, remove the hair very, very easily without resulting in ends that are split feeling or destroying the cuticle. So hopefully that answers some of your challenges in your razor cuts, also will inspire more confidence from your clients in receiving a razor cut. So the next time you pull out that razor, make sure you pay really close attention to those angles and we guarantee you're gonna have a much better result. Thanks for watching. I'm Andrew Carruthers, Education Director for Sam.